DigiScan has been focusing on preparing material for enrichment of education in oral pathology and oral histology. These sites are popular among postgraduate students as well as faculty because of the quality of the cases and clarity of the digital images. The set of MDS exam cases has been prepared to help the postgraduate students of oral pathology in making the correct diagnosis of exam slides. DigiScan has prepared a set of MDS exam cases of oral pathology where large number of important cases encountered in all types of oral lesions, neoplastic or non-neoplastic have been discussed with the aim of helping the postgraduate students diagnose the slides during examination. This site is in great demand by PGs for preparing for exam and by the faculty for assessment of students for examination. Highlights of the set. The set has been divided into two parts. First, MDS exam questions and second, MDS exam answers. Each slide has been given a unique number like C001, 002, 003 and so on. Digital image of every case is provided with pertinent clinical history and the viewer is supposed to make the diagnosis. Here is the clinical history to see another case. This is the clinical history of the case. And the second is MDS exam answer folder. Slide is the answer folder is given the same unique number like 001. 002003 the answer is explained with the help of labeled whole slide image with annotation to see the here is the uh, description of the case and labeling see the cell here is epithelial cell with pink cytoplasm vesicular nuclei and indistinct nucleoli Another case, this set has been uh, about 70 cases, cases which required ISC for diagnosis. In those cases, ISC images has been provided for confirmation of diagnosis like CD31 of angiosarcoma, tumor is positive, positive cells, another ISC, it is recommended that each participant or postgraduate should go through the slide set of oral pathology which has annotated and labeled slides of large number of lesions of oral pathology. Anyone who has gone through this set cannot make wrong diagnosis in most of the cases which are received in the department of oral pathology. New cases encountered are added to the set periodically. Thank you.